Hello folks, welcome back to Build It With Smith. I'm your host Smith and we're tuned, you are tuned in to episode 2. We're going to be looking at uh, Cityscapes Sim Builder. And so let's jump right into where we were at. Uh, city Manager Don was telling us about the City Pass. So I guess we do actually have to see what that's about. Alright. City Manager Don, good morning to you. Or, you know. Complete tasks to earn progress. Each City Pass season has exclusive buildings, landmarks, plus other special items. So if you're not familiar with this type of concept, in this... Uh, game there's going to be somewhat of a competition you can see that there's uh 24 days going on this one 21 hours and so you are to uh do these different tasks and they're pretty self-explanatory when you look at them and as you complete as you complete the task um you advance in the rankings here and you can get these items and so there's a theme for the items in this particular uh this particular event and it is the tulips of amsterdam now i've never been to amsterdam but i've heard it can be a lot of fun um so anyway let's get into the game um all right, so we can get some special buildings here by spending what they're calling votes. And I believe that this, let's click here. Yeah, so this is the votes. And I don't know how you earn them. I don't know if that is going to be their currency in the game or not. Now, we have 150. We could spend that on the Leaning Tower of Pisa, but I don't want to do that unless they're going to give it to me for free. Now, there's also some buildings that we can get here. Now, what's the deal with these? So, these are... These are... I don't really know how this works, and I'm just learning just like you guys are, but what it appears to me is that you can also purchase these buildings, and there's a daily limit of the buildings that you can purchase. Um, there also appears to... So, there appears to be up here four housing uh buildings and then uh i guess that's commercial and industrial yeah that's what they are there all right so anyway we've we've seen that let's that we haven't even gotten into the game yet folks all right so we're back in the can let's go back into our city which is called river valley i don't remember calling it river valley so we'll have to uh come up with a name there hopefully all right, let's go ahead and get in. Okay, folks, so if you have been, if you're still here four minutes later, we have just now entered into our city. And uh, there's a lot of things that seem to be going on. You may have seen this at the end of the last episode, too. Uh, a parade. I don't know why there's a parade right here. They're kind of blocking a little bit of traffic. Is this a grand opening or what's happening? I don't really know. Uh, what else is going on here? Is this a... Is... Is this a... What is this? Uh, let's say it's a block party. I think it's a block party, maybe. Everybody's got suits on, so I don't know if they're protesting. Is this a... So I don't know, but... Um, so anyway, lots of activity going on in our city. Let's keep it going. Oh, and... A crash with signs I don't know what's happening here is this something we should pay attention to oh now they're gone just like that they're gone okay all right so let's go back and get back to what we were doing here um so a couple of things we can accomplish at the top left is we can raise the city level and uh, well we need to do that one more time our city level gauge our city level gauge, I believe it's this one at the top. Is this the one? I think that's it. I may be wrong. I may have to come back in the comments and say, hey guys, I was wrong. That was not what I thought it was. 
Uh, but anyway, one thing that we can do is we can build or upgrade our water building. And I think we're going to do that. So let's see. Clicking on the water building, um, it has produced not enough water. And so what is this range? So I didn't know this before. But are you telling me that I have to move this water tower over so that it serves... So I guess this is the only area that is serving here. And we can upgrade it, and it looks like upgrading it will add 750 more um, capacity for the water that we can produce, and maybe it will extend our range one plus. Let's do that. All right, and city manager Don comes out and she says, hey mayor, a building was unhappy for too long and now it's abandoned. This has caused your approval to go down. Well, thank you for the, you know, bearer of bad news right here. Um, luckily, it's easy to rebuild. Just select the big red button over the building and uh, to rebuild it. When rebuilt buttons, wait, when, re when rebuilt, when rebuilt, a building's level is reduced. Oh, okay. When rebuilt, comma, a building's level is reduced by one. Gotcha. All right. So, um, let's just do that. I guess that's what we're doing now. We're rebuilding, and is that going to cost us money to repair? Oh, but that's also counting as one of our buildings uh, upgrade. So, I think when we do this other one, oh, project expired. What is what? Oh, we were what? We come on guys. So I guess that expired. Does that mean that we didn't get Okay, so I guess there's a time limit on these things. So we need to find another something else happening here. All right. We got more buildings abandoning. Uh we're all employed and need jobs now. What? There are jobs. Just go up the street here. Are there not enough jobs? needs 115 water so i mean these are the folks in this city are kind of starting to get on my nerves a little bit for this episode because i mean i'm trying to get here and just kind of check it out shake hands be a good mayor and you got folks complaining up complaining you up and down all right so i'm gonna have to do another water tower <clears throat> and we're gonna place it somewhere where we can get that good old 750 capacity if that's possible to get that again it appears that's going to work right there we build it okay so now did we raise our city level or not that didn't do it all right, so we gotta we've gotta build some more buildings. So before we just go on a building frenzy, let's make an educated decision as to what kind of buildings we need to put. Now let's see what what folks are saying here. We're all unemployed, need jobs now, need a hundred factory jobs. Oh, you know what? Pause, pause that, because I can see that they were about to all leave the building. We need seven hundred jobs, okay? And so. I guess we're going to have to put some dirty fact factories into production. So there's one right there. No problem with that. And so they said they need 700 jobs. Oh, what's going on here? Did we drop that? Oh, that's right. We're paused. Okay. So unpause. Okay. Is there an extra? Did I? Did I press this? I don't think I. I don't think I placed this in the exactly where I wanted to put it. So, is there a way to move the buildings? Yes, there is. So as you can see, I just clicked that button, and now I can. Can I? Yes, I can move the building over. All right. So this is another good. This is another good um, attribute about the game because I just made that mistake and I'm glad that I was able to um, rectify it. So let's see. Oh, pause again. Why aren't you guys going to work? 
Mr. Hundred and Hundred and Fifty. Or Mr. Hundred and Fifty. I don't know what's going on with them. Do they not have a way to get to work? I mean, I'm pretty sure we have enough buildings for you now. Oh, it's still getting built. Okay, so I kind of jumped the gun there. Maybe now that the place is open for 200 workers, can some of you... Oh, they left. All right, they left. All right, so I don't... I wouldn't say, guys, that we're doing a great job right now because folks are, are leaving quicker than we can keep them there. Um, so that place, so we got to repair. So we're doing a lot of... We're doing a lot of work. Now, things are still happening... And, you know, I don't know. More folks are coming into the city, and it looks like... Do they need places to shop yet? I think we need to go ahead and, and be proactive with this factory stuff here. Now, is there a way... Let me click. Okay, so this, this tells you more about the levels, right? So, let's see. Can I navigate this? or? Okay, so this does not move. Uh, I can't scroll at this point right now. But we can look and see what is at the next level, things that we will unlock. And maybe this is a spoiler for you guys, but I wanted to see. So we need uh, 375 more people. Or no, yeah, we need 275 more people in the house. And so let's try to make that happen. And it looks like it's already kind of happening because folks, oh, folks are moving out or in. Are they moving out or in? All right, I think we got a steady good number of people. Let's bring some more houses in. That's what we really need to do at this point. Let's keep the neighborhood going. Oh, was that my commercial? No, the commercial didn't. Yeah, not there. Okay, so let's let's just uh, do six more houses here. We may not be able to squeeze in this other one because of the curve here. So that's that's okay. All right, let's see what we got. So so now we're dropping houses like bombs. And they're all looking pretty nice. Uh, let's go ahead and zoom in and see what's happening in our city now. So we've got our main street here. I don't understand what's happening here. Is it the roads? Or the road, maybe it's the roads. Maybe, maybe we need to upgrade the roads. Is that what it is? Select roads to edit. And that's to edit roads. Um, I tell you what, I'm sure Don will come through for us, and we've just unlocked city level five, five k in our bank, and we're looking pretty good at our bank. Eighty six thousand dollars. Now we're up to ninety one thousand dollars, almost ninety two thousand dollars. Okay, you have new blueprints to place. We get a elm grove, a grass patch, a cement patch, uh, apartment condos, apartment and condo towers. That should be nice. And a cement parking lot. That's also nice. So, oh, here's someone. Hello, I'm Valerie Vista. Oh, hello there. Or is it Vista? I'm Valerie Vista. It's a pleasure to meet you. I'm in charge of the city's sustainability. Okay. From here on out, you're going to need to pay close attention to your sustainability score. So that's the score down there. It's a currently at zero. Parks will increase the sustainability of the city. That is correct. Green power buildings and other buildings that improve the social goodwill will also increase the sustainability of the city. It is easy to increase your sustainability if you're careful with your planning. So let's check this out now. All right, some parts, some, place some parts to increase your sustainability before going to the next city level. All right, uh, we're going to take your advice there, Valerie Vista, because you're the expert. And so, um, let's see, which one of these? So I think <clears throat> what would make the most sense is let's go ahead and put some, some concrete parking lots. Uh, where should we put those? Can we drop that right there? All right, we'll put a, but 
but I guess, okay, maybe it should be more like a park and ride sort of situation because we also do want to affect the building. So, um, and I think it only matters about affecting the residential buildings. So where would be the best place to place uh, these, these guys? And you also want to think, why, where would you put a parking lot? Why would you put a parking lot here? So, um, we may put it there, you know, we may put it there or we may put it on the main road right here. Um, oh, maybe I wasn't paying attention. So looking at this, um, I wonder, okay, look at the status there. So we've got residential, it says negative 60. And then we've got adding 30 on to the commercial and the industrial buildings. Um, so I guess this, I don't know if this, maybe this doesn't work the way that I thought it does. Let's go ahead, let's go ahead and do this. Let's drop us a parking lot right there. That's going to be the parking ride. Okay, and so let's take a look. So what I was thinking, and maybe I should have listened. Let me go back and listen to, where is she? Where did she go? She's gone. Okay, Valerie's gone. So I guess we did what we were supposed to do there. That's all I'm going to say. I thought we would probably need to do a little more. Um, and we can. We can put more. We can put more uh, parts or whatever. But what do we have here? All right, so I just clicked on that uh, icon there. The exclamation mark and it says rocks and trees uh oh okay so this reduces air pollution by 50. so okay so these are things that we can do to reduce the air pollution now how can i see the air pollution and why are you guys acting like we don't already have workers what's the problem okay now this guy is saying we don't have a place to shop so now we have to put a new place for the folks to shop. But you know what? It was almost about time for that anyway. So, uh, yeah, we're going to do that right there. All right, so that'll help them out. I don't understand why all of a sudden they don't have any workers. Do y'all have enough workers? And they need water. Okay, so maybe can we move our water tower? Because this seems to be such a rising issue. This thing of water. Mm -hmm. And so let's let's put it right there. That actually covers. Yeah, that actually covers everyone in the range that we're at. So people should be a little more grateful. And we've got folks. Are they going shopping? Let's see what boss. Oh. I would like to read some of these. Did you hear that they opened up a half size cubicle company? Oh, okay, so she's gonna find it. Oh, okay, that's pretty cool. All right, we got some money from that. This is kind of entertaining. I can sit here and just, you know, tap around. All right, what you gotta say, buddy? Oh, the mayor just put in that new half size cubicles company. You're right. I can go there after I get off work at the electrics furnace. Okay, that's what you guys want to do. That's fine with me. Okay, so uh, what else can we do here? So we still need to increase the city level. We need to put two more buildings. I see that uh, something is happening here. It is letting us know to go ahead and put the apartment towers. Now, we also have one more building that we could drop right here, and I think we'll do that. And I think we'll put the apartment towers on this curve right here, like that. And so we're gonna extend the neighbor, we're gonna keep the neighborhood, this neighborhood. We got some more road, we'll go, uh, what do you guys think? I mean, obviously I, I don't know what you're, what you're thinking, but would you have put the, would you just kept building? I think we're gonna do that because again, 
the cool thing about this let me just make sure it works for this i can move these buildings astronomical that is an astronomical and i mean that in a good way that is an that is a great um feature Okay, now they need more water. Oh yeah, it looks like you do. Okay, that's valid. So um, let's just move our water tower here. Well, we could upgrade it, but let's move it to a better place. That's gonna make more sense for us. And looks like we're just gonna have to increase so let's cancel that and let's just see about increasing the capacity of the water tower hopefully it extends itself and it doesn't really but you know we got it in kind of a dumb place right now because there's nothing going on over there so we can move it we can move it um, and I think we're gonna we're gonna have to keep it somewhere around here. Yeah, let's say let's keep it right there. Uh, yeah, let's keep it right there because we can move it back one more. You know what? We'll, we'll move it back one more. Maybe we'll put a park in there. But this gives a good coverage of what we're trying to get accomplished. So let's go ahead and drop that. Mm -hmm. I realize there's a building going on over here that we'll actually have to move because they need water. No, we don't want to remove it. We want to move it. What? Oh, you want to remove this building? Can I? Oh, I'm hitting the wrong button. All right, that button kind of threw me off. It's a recycle button. And what they actually mean is they're going to demolish it, but, uh, or maybe they're going to recycle it. I don't know. Okay, so we're going to now <clears throat> continue on this street. We're going to go down that street. All right. This person needs some water. You're correct, sir. You do need some water. So let's uh, go back to the water. And let's get something for... I would say this area right here. We'll put it, we'll place it here for right now. We can move it. Okay. All right. So now I want to see how these apartment condos are going to look. Don't you guys want to see? So let's go ahead and try one of those out. We can do one for right now. We can't put one on the curb, but that's okay because we weren't going to anyway. Now, I just thought of this as well. For a point, okay, I think we're going to put these right across the street from the commercial buildings. Yeah, I think we're going to put them right across the street from the commercial buildings um, because I think it'll look nice. All right, so there's our one apartment tower. Oh, this isn't a tower. This is not a tower at all, guys. Okay, so maybe it's going to grow up to be big and strong one day but um let's check on see what's going on here so things are still moving folks are still um hammering and now i don't know what's going on here i think it has something to do with the roads but i don't recall city manager don coming and telling us how to upgrade the roads um uh, yeah, I mean, I don't know. You know, I don't want to jump ahead because they may say, hey, you can put a stoplight here, you know, so who knows? All right. So the next thing we need to do and what we're going to do to accomplish here is we're going to build some more buildings and hope that that will raise the city level. Now, how are folks tracking? Everybody seems to be happy except for these guys who are crying about water. And all we'll do for that, because, buddy, you have water. All we'll do for that is we'll just give you more water. So that's going on. All right. I don't know if we're going to reach city level six because we're already 25 minutes into the video. And we only have about half of the uh, population that I think it takes. Now, I don't understand 
why our sustainability is at zero. So maybe what we need to do is go find some parks. And I think that's what we'll do. Maybe that's what Don was trying to tell, or what was her name, Valerie? Maybe mm -hmm. that's what she was trying to tell us, is that we might need to, we might need to um, put some more parts in. Now, where was that again? Which, which one, is this the parts? Yeah, that's the parts, okay. So, Elm Grove, we could definitely, we can definitely, let's see. We can definitely do that. Let's put that, as a matter of fact, let's put that right there. Or, it's not really helping the road there, is it? Okay, well, I guess this is one thing, this is one thing that I do not know. Does it matter where I place this? It doesn't really look like it matters. Well, it does because it affects more of these. But, um, but, um, I wouldn't place it there because, uh, you know, the road is getting a lot. Okay, so I understand. Here's what I'm going to do, guys. Check it out. We'll start with this. Since these buildings are kind of the same, <clears throat> what we'll do is we'll move one over here. And then we'll go back to our park. We'll click on it again. And we'll put our gazebo right there. Or I, uh, the elm. The, the elm grove, I think it's called. Is that what it's called? Elm grove. So we put that there. All right, folks should be a little right, more well, happy here. to learn. But folks, again, are mad about something. And what are they saying? We need some more shopping. Folks always want to spend money. I'm trying to help them out, teach them how to save a little bit. But um, they don't want to hear me. All right, so there's a... But we, we, we like increasing the look of downtown. So we'll give you guys some place to shop. And what's happening with the water? needs to be covered by water that produces oh um that's right that's right we moved so um i knew we would have another location for this so let's put him is that close enough for now just so that they can stop threatening to move out and everything are we good with the water now I retired from my donut company to work at the strip mall. Okay. I was fed up with the whole business. Okay, that's a funny one. All right, now they have water. Are we still needing places to shop? What's the problem? So I guess they want more places to shop. They didn't like they didn't like the first place I provided for them. Let's see. We'll give them another, another shopping area. Okay, so they need 400, they need 285 shopping now. So, I wonder if we can up, can, would anything upgrade? Thanks for turning the water back on, Mayor. You got it, buddy. Oh, okay. So, we're running low on power. We're running low... On things they say they want more commercial buildings let's see so they claim they need more shopping so let's let's go ahead and we'll help them out and like I said I think I'm gonna this little corner here I kind of feel like I want to preserve that for something else um, I don't know what but it might be something else we will just place this we'll place it Actually, I want to I want to move this now. All right, guys. If you are not familiar with Build It With Smith, now's the time to tell you. I spend a lot of my time doing this, moving things to and fro. Uh, you know. So you know, this is just part of what happens in Smith videos. I may put something down, and then I may decide the next second it doesn't look right. And that is just the nature of city building games. Um, and they, you know, they can also, they can also, uh, 
as you can see, there's there's always constantly someone asking for something. So uh, you got to find the balance between enjoying your city and also making sure that your residences are happy. Now, I'm, I'm going to bring this to a close here. Because uh, we're coming, we're, 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 we're pat, we, we are past 30 minutes on the video. So I don't want to take up too much of your time, but I need to see more comments from you guys. If you're watching the videos, go ahead and uh, leave a comment. Let's, um, let me know what you think about this game and we will move on to the next episode. These are really easy and fun to record, but, um. Well, right now it's about 1030 at night, so uh, I'm about to kind of gear down. So I hope you guys had a great day, or I hope it's a good morning, or I hope you're having a good night, whichever one. And uh, thanks for clicking on the video. See you guys next time. Peace out.